An important aspect of Toratex and Stadler's collaboration was, of course, the fact that both of us are German companies. And both of us have committed ourselves to offering European products to our customers. Just like Turatec, we buy all our materials on the European market. We're producing in Europe and we've got our own small manufactory, right here in Germany, and our own development department. Only this way it was possible to develop a high-end standard product in a relatively short period of time. Especially when it comes to the choice of materials for Companiero, it's been crucial to improve all the existing systems that are currently on the market. So far, we have either had laminate jackets or modular jackets. We agreed on combining the advantages of laminate with the advantages of modular gear. This is why we decided to use a Gore-Tex Pro Shell laminate. Its breathability is much better than in other set liner designs or other modular designs. In this case, laminate means we've got an outer layer made of Cordura, a functional layer made by Gore, the so-called Gore membrane, and a backside layer that's protecting the membrane. This makes a very lightweight product that doesn't absorb any water. It dries quickly and is extremely robust when used under professional conditions. The difference between a pro shell laminate and a standard laminate by Gore is the increase of approximately 25% more breathability. That's the difference between pro shell laminates and performance shell laminates. This is why pro shell laminates are only used in very specific applications, which either attract professional users or those who are asking much more of their outfits than standard Gore-Tex products would bear. The laminate's specific features are, of course, the minimum increase of weight and the ability to dry very quickly. A new suit will dry within 15 minutes, supported by airflow while driving. Spending a night in a tent won't be any problem either. Since the outer material virtually doesn't absorb any water, your jacket won't be wet the next morning. Unlike in set liner jackets, there's no air layer between the outer material and the membrane. The membrane is completely fixed. This guarantees a quick drying. You can really say that, regardless of how bad the weather conditions outside your tent may be, the next morning your jacket will be dry, no matter what. As far as the summer combination is concerned, our goal was extreme ventilation, without making the jacket look like being made of lining fabrics. This is why we've decided to use Cordura 500 for the predominant part of it, combined with Cordura AFT. Compared with usual mesh materials, Cordura AFT is opaque. Im Vergleich zu normalen Meshmaterial den Vorteil, es ist blickdicht, ist deutlich. It's clearly more abrasion resistant than polyester materials are. And it still provides an extreme airflow, like T-shirt materials do. Vergleichbar mit einem T-shirt Material. When it came to the choice of the Cordura 500 material, there were several options. Basically, Cordura 500 always has a special reverse side treatment, usually a PU coating, to ensure the stability of the seams, especially when washed. The disadvantage of this reverse side treatment is, however, a reduction in breathability. The Gore company set up standards here that have to be maintained for all Gore products. This is something you can achieve by using PU coatings. 
The reverse side we use is made of a mesh material. It's punctually fixed, which is a huge advantage because this provides a better breathability and the longevity of the product is clearly increased. A usual PU reverse side will be abrased while being used and will also be worn out by the washing process. Sooner or later there won't be much of the reverse side coating left, but the mesh material we use will still be in its original state even after it has been washed a hundred times. It may feel a bit softer, but it will always stabilize the seams. Grip, breathability and longevity will be definitely improved. Another specific feature, the summer jacket has a net lining, of course, to increase the airflow. But also, the protector area is made of a special lining material. It's a 3D mesh, as we know it from the sportswear sector. It's used for backpacks, when material and straps are not supposed to fit too tightly. We're using an identical material here, in the area of the back protectors. It makes sure that the back protector is never 100% in contact with the body. Here we have an explicit distance to the body, in addition to the channels inside the protector itself. This provides a better ventilation of the entire area, less perspiration and less discomfort. Of course, it's important to our customers that we only use state-of-the-art materials and that acquisition and further processing are carried out in an effective production process. To guarantee this, 99.9% .9 of all the materials we use are certified by Hohenstein, that is Ökotex standard. This way, consumers can be sure that these products are free of hazardous substances. Furthermore, we've got manufacturer certificates for all of our materials. This is something that's also required by our customers in the military and emergency services. This quality standard is maintained for civilian customers as well. The materials are really adequate, identical and they are always additionally verified by Gore, especially when you offer the product as a Gore product. We are obliged to send every material to Gore, where it is tested for its spray value or steam penetrability, just to make sure that everything from lining to outer material matches the Gore standards. This is, for instance, what a Gore certificate looks like. As you can see here, they have set these minimal values, which are clearly undercut by our laminated product. So, as far as the breathability is concerned, we're far ahead of the minimum standards required by Gore.